Oh, oh, it's heavy. Oh, go. What is? <gasps> Welcome to another vlog. Welcome to a. This one is a really random. Actually, I'm going to be defrosting my freezer with my hair dryer. I saw someone do it on Instagram, I was like, well, I, I need to do that. If you've watched my food shop hauls, you'll know that my freezer is a little bit battered. Let me show you it. Oh, and there's been more damage since my last food shop haul. So as you can see, we've got this lovely shelf and this, this lovely wad of ice. This is the latest crack. My heart is broken. You wanna know why my heart is broken? So I already planned on doing the whole defrost the freezer and buy a new top drawer. And then, just as I was like thinking about doing it, that second drawer cracked. And why am I so sad about you ask? Guess how much replacement freezer drawers are? Guess. No, actually, please genuinely guess and comment below because I was thinking £20 maximum. Went online, put my little number that my fridge is, all the details in. £80. 80 80 pounds for a plastic drawer. Is Bosch mugging us off or what? But they know they crack and they break, so they've just gone, I know, let me just um um 83 pounds. I'm shocked to the core! A few people said on Instagram to look on eBay. I looked on eBay and I found 50 quid. I'm still hell to the no. Hell to the no. To the no, no, no. But someone said they found with like 15 pounds. So there is hope. But let's first defrost the freezer. Wish me luck because as you all know, I'm kind of quite minimal. So I don't have a lot of towels. We might be swimming in my swim, swimming in my kitchen later. Before we start the freezer, can we just talk about the fact that it's actually getting cold now and none of my jeans really fit me that well? What am I meant to wear? Like legitimately, has anyone got this struggle? I have no clothes. I'm already not really an autumn winter person when it comes to fashion anyway. I need to find what I like myself in. But when you don't fit in any of your clothes, that's a slight issue. So anyway, the reason why I'm telling you that is because I was just going to be like, oh, OOTD, vlogger style, you know, because I'm such a great vlogger. Um, oh, I haven't made my bed this morning. <laughs> don't even look at that. We have some slippers from Tesco. Moving up. We've got some misguided joggers, which, you know what, I actually really like these. And I would like them in like a, a creamy, nudie beigey sort of colour. Obviously a Zara basic top because do I live in them? Yes I do. And then I've just thrown on this shirt to cover up my insecurities. What's that? Hi hum, what are you doing here? Top was five pounds. I know, breaking the bank with this one. I like it, it's long at the back. Five pounds from Primarche. So this is the outfit that no one cared about. Press, 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 press. Cardi don't need no press. That's really stuck in my head. Don't think the freezer needs a diffuser now, do we? Oh, why is that so big? Look how frizzy my hair looks in that light. Wow. <gasps> oh, that bit just cracked. This is actually a hazard. Oh my, no, I'm scared. I'm gonna get like cut or something. I timed it for when I don't have much food. I'm clearly due another food shop, right? Let's just put that in there. Oh, I forgot about this. Cheeky little flatbread. Probably won't help me with the fact that I can't fit in my jeans though, will it? And we're ready. Right, where can I put you? How long is this gonna take? Work it! It's proper dripping now. One thing I will say is, gives you a bit of an arm ache. Oh, I can't open it. Oh! 
I'll normally eat plastic in my eye. That's it. Look at that! Day, I've been able to pull off big chunks of ice from the top bit. I've never seen the silver bit before. Right, so look, this bit can just take right off. And I'm just chucking it in the sink, obviously. Woo! I've just noticed a problem. So you see this? I don't have that on the other side, so it's sort of just hanging. I mean, it's not a massive problem, but I didn't know it was a problem. It was getting held up by ice. Oh god, oh god, oh god, oh god, oh god, oh god, oh it's heavy, oh my god, it's so heavy, oh my god. Ah! Oh, it's like Titanic in there. Oh my god, this has just reminded me of, on bad girls, when they stabbed the person with the ice, and then obviously the evidence melted. So it's all defrosted and all cleaned. Is this boring? <laughs> I would watch this crap. So anyway, I'm gonna show you what it looks like. I'm, 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 is that my freezer? Da da! I'm so impressed. All I've got to do now is clean these. Look at all that ice. Just gotta clean these. Oh, and this is like my fridge organizers. And someone sent me a photo on Instagram where they had these, but I'm guessing they were bigger and they used those as drawers instead. That might be an option, seeing as drawers are 50 to 80 pounds, which is an absolute ridiculous joke. So I might go to B&M. Should we go to B&M? Maybe I could super glue this and then just replace this one. I use this as a shelf anyway. God, look at that, it looks so fresh. Is this what people's freezers actually look like? But with like a little bit of ice. Oh, and here it is with my minimal food. I think I need a hammer and then I could crack this off and this could just be a shelf and then maybe super glue this up and it'd be good as new. So I've just sorted out the kitchen and tidied up everywhere. I'm not making my bed, but I packed the clothes away. And I don't know if you saw, but whilst I was washing up, I was watching The Fall. If you follow me on Instagram, you'll know that I was obsessed with Lufa. Then a few people said, I think you're like The Fall. Started watching it, I'm obsessed. I'm on season two, episode three already. I've heard the ending's a bit rubbish, but I can't stop watching it. Don't tell me what the ending is, no spoilers, but so far, I'm really, really liking it. So if you like like crime stuff, stuff that seems so realistic that you're literally laying in bed thinking he's gonna come in and throttle you, then you'll really enjoy it. nothing that I went in for at all. They didn't have any of the like big fridge freezer thingy my bobbies. And I ended up coming out with a whole bag full of stuff. I actually needed all this stuff. I just didn't realise until I saw it, you know? So let's do a little mini B and M haul. Don't know how interesting this is, but hey ho. First up we've got some Radox. I know riveting stuff. Some mouthwash. Some Tampex. Fairy, I know, so interesting. Some Doritos for my dinner. It's chili con carne for like dinner. Mint dimes. Now that is exciting. I've never tried mint dimes. I tried the orange ones, they're nice. And I just thought, I'll have this after dinner. These are just so nice. I remember getting these after school, if you cared. Paint brushes, because when I did my shed decluttering, I had none. And there is something I want to paint, so I just got a packet. Oh, there is something exciting. How cute is this? So my clean with me is going live tonight, and I thought this, if 
you watch it, you'll see me scrubbing my vinyl. This would be perfect for that. And it's so cute. It's got this little bamboo handle. How cute. It proper goes in my kitchen. I love it. And I thought that'd be easier. Instead of using the fake minky, I can really... Some dental wipes. Some razors. Because I wasn't able to get the freezer drawer alternative, I got some glue. So I'm going to try and glue the second drawer. And that is everything I got. I know it's so exciting, but there was more exciting stuff in that clip I showed. really want them shelves. I really, really want them. The gold ones that I think you can put plants on it. I just, I always look at it, never get it. Story of my life. One day though, it's in there, it's in there. I'm going to make some chili con carne. I'm so hungry. I'm so hungry. Ow. Oh. Oh, I felt that. Oh, all down here hurt so bad. That sounded like it was my back, but it wasn't. Uh, I'm crying. <laughs> oh no. A clickbait thumbnail. Worst day ever. Ugh. You might think I'm really weird, but I know some people do it, but basically I hate kidney beans. So my mum always put baked beans in the chili con carne. I personally love it, but I know people think it's slightly odd. I also like it in my cottage pie. <laughs> Jesus, I've made enough to feed a family of eight. No meal I ever make really tastes the same. Like, I've made chili con carne so many times, but I just love adding bits, I never measure them things out. I feel like it just tastes different every time. I guess it, you know, spices thing up, spices things up a little, a little bit, you know. It's spicy. Have you seen that TikTok? I need to get off TikTok. Here it is with my chili heat wave. Never had Doritos with my chili before until my stepmom did it and now I literally can't imagine life without Doritos and chili. It's just such a good combo. It's been approximately 20 seconds since I finished dinner and obviously I need to try my dime. It tastes like a chocolate covered candy cane. I prefer a normal dime, it's nice, but I prefer a normal dime. I need to watch that bag. <laughs> that has given me a full on like, like a headache, kind of like a head rush. Ow. I can't really pop it. I'm going to go glue the freezer before I get in bed and watch the full. Exciting. I think this might work, you know. This might work. Oh, I don't know about that. Doesn't feel strong enough. Oh no, oh. It's like some sort of snot. <laughs> Am I making it worse? Probably. I'm a bit annoyed at myself not checking that it wouldn't dry clear. It looks clearer on here than it does in real life, but look, it works. Give the video a thumbs up, subscribe, put the bell on, and I'll see you in my next video. Love you so much. I don't love you, I don't know you. If you've watched my Can Influencers Really Be Honest video, you'll know what I'm on about. When I say love you, you're my best friend. Give the video a thumbs up, like, subscribe. Bye. Ow! Oh, oh my god, I just pulled my groin.